So as you guys can see, I have a trash room, a sleeping baby, and I'm going to try and get as much cleaning done with her asleep as I can. And I'll just take you with me on what it's like to try and do a night routine, a cleaning night routine with a newborn. So she has this new formula. Um, I think it's like whole wheat or something. I think they found out she has a few allergens, so they're trying that with her, but it seems to keep her stomach from getting upset, so I love it. We have, of course, our lovely caddy that we always take with us around the house. I'm going to get to cleaning. So the first step in cleaning up is going to be getting a dirty slash clean clothes pile, a stuff that needs to go downstairs pile, and then stuff that just has to get put away around the room pile. So I'm going to start doing that now. I'm starting at... 9 46 so i'll let you know when i get done so it is 10 o'clock still going strong with the sleeping baby blessed to say but trash pile clean clothes pile stuff that needs to get put away also same thing and then dirty clothes as well as some shoes so i will get back to you guys when that's done okay so not too bad we're looking at 10 20 got all the piles put away the bags look way more organized it's not as messy over here that trash has to go downstairs and then the next thing i'm gonna do is fold those clothes because they are clean um i just finished making sure that all of these look good as well as adding a few touches since i was unpacking from a church trip that was successful i'm gonna put the laptop away now she is still asleep but i don't think she'll stay asleep because She's already been asleep for an hour, so she'll probably wake up and want that soon. But I'm going to start folding clothes. Okay, I'm literally only like six things in, and she's crying like I thought. So I'm just going to go ahead and get her bottle ready and uh, give her just a bit of a feeding and hopefully get her back to sleep for a little bit longer. All I'm going to do is give her some milk. She was like, what is this? And she figured it out, I guess. But, yeah, I'm just going to give her a little bit of this. There's not really anything I can do folding-wise because I really only have one hand free right now. So, I'm just going to try and feed her as much as she's willing to take. And then, hopefully, that will put her back to sleep. <laughs> okay, so she slowed down a little bit. I'm trying to get this bottle on to uh, go back down the bag so you guys can see. So she started at four ounces, it's down to three. Um, I literally forgot to put a bib on her, so thank god she didn't <laughs> spit up yet. <laughs> but I'm just gonna give her a little bit of a burp. I don't see any poop in her diaper or anything like that, so we're good on that front. Got a little bit of spit up there. I'm just going to check her diaper just to make sure. But she should be, yeah, she's good. Say, I'm good, mommy. Okay, so what I'm going to do is get her back in her bouncer. Okay, so I got her back bundled up and she seems to have quieted down. So hopefully I can get these clothes done. All right, so we've got an empty basket. And... Baby girl is still knocked out. I'm going to put these clothes away and then try and feed her because I'm going to go downstairs and cook dinner and I want her to stay asleep. All right, no more clothes, which is great. It just looks way better in here um, overall. So now what I'm going to do is give her some more milk. So, now that she's done with that, let's see, I think she just has just a little bit of spit up already. Nothing crazy. She did drink and not the majority of it, which is good. Just going to give her a little burp here. Mm, and got just a little bit of spit up, which is fine. That's normal for her. So, before I go downstairs and try and do anything... I'm going to go ahead and check her diaper. Oh, speaking of check her diaper, that's not good. Oh, no. Okay, I guess what we're going to do is just, I don't know if you guys can see that, but yeah, she's just a little wet. 
Um, so what I'm going to do is I have her night clothes here. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and get her into her night clothes and then change and change her diaper since clearly she's wet. <laughs> So now that she's fed and changed, which was a mess, I'm going to clean up the mess I made getting her ready for bed, and then I will see you guys downstairs. I'm going to be making some fried chicken for dinner. I just cleaned everything, now we're adding some seasoning, and then I'll go in with the flour, of course. sleep i just finished cooking and i'm gonna eat and then we'll wrap up her night routine all right guys so i just got back upstairs she is still asleep but i'm just gonna change her diapers so that she can sleep a little bit longer and that'll be the end and just as i thought since her last bottle she has definitely used the bathroom a bit so i'm just gonna go ahead and change her okay so she's all dry